Hello everybody, my name is Flare31 and welcome back to Pokemon Crystal Version. In the last episode, we explored Goldenrod City and battled some people in the underground, checked out the game corner, and that was, that was really about it. We also got the uh, the radio card at the radio tower, so that, that's all neat and stuff. And this episode, we're going to take on the gym and then probably move on from Goldenrod, but... Before I do that, I'm going to mention that I looked a little bit more into my team and the moves I wanted. And I decided that I don't particularly care about getting the TMs available in the game corner. And so I didn't bother. Um, yeah, that's all I got to say about that. So let's uh, go ahead and go into the gym. Yo, champion making. This gym is home to normal type Pokemon trainers. I recommend you use fighting type Pokemon. Yeah, so. This is where having the Machop that's available for a trade would be kind of nice. Oh, you are a cute little trainer. I like you, but I won't hold back. Alright, thanks. Thanks, lady. And you have a Sentra, okay. That's uh, it's pretty solid. It's pretty solid, but I've got a pop quiz. Oh no, everyone's worst nightmare. Let's just use Confusion. Confusion's probably worth it. Uh, we'll use another one. I don't believe in Scratch's power to finish, up, finish off the Sentra. Another Centret. Oh, this one's higher level though. It's uh, not fun. Oh, uh, that's really not fun. I don't like that. Hmm. We'll try Scratch, why not? The lack of stab right now is killing me on this Pokemon. Oh my god, this thing's level 17. Oh. Don't take a ton of damage. Oh, that's a lot of damage. It's a lot more than I wanted it to be. And that's a lot less than I wanted it to be. But it's not surprising. Yeah, this might be um this might be a problem. We'll have to see. Okay, that's not too bad. Oh no. Oh, okay, that's fine. I don't know what's up with literally every multi-hit move hitting like two times on average, but uh, I'll take it. Let's see. Oops, it's over. Alright, I'm gonna heal. Alright, let's go past you and around. And fight this person. Give it your best shot, or I'll take you down. A Meowth, okay. Oh boy. It has, it has already begun. Man. I need a better move than Confusion, but it's gonna be a little bit rough here for a little bit. Honestly, if it ain't broke, don't fix it. 
But also, I kind of don't want you using Bite. Though, I guess it doesn't matter. Oh boy. I thought my Switch training days were over. Guess I was mistaken. Get out of my face. I don't want to see hide nor hair of you ever again. Thank you. Oh, you have a second Pokemon. I think I have one for some reason. This is kind of annoying. <laughs> Ooh, you got burned. Nice. That's okay, though. We'll just wipe you off the board and then went to heal again. I feel like it's a trend. No. Oh, Meowth, I'm so sorry. I don't know what you're sorry for. And thanks for the free money, I guess. Man, look at this. Look how sad that is. It's level 17, I can't do anything. <sighs> I'm making a power play. I'm gonna buy one Ice Punch TM. And with this Ice Punch TM, I will... Eh. Teach it. To... Pop Quiz, because... It should help it, I would imagine. Uh, let's just get, with, get rid of Tail Whip. I feel like Tail Whip's not gonna be that. Not gonna be overly useful for me. Alright. First floor. Let's get out of here. Bottom side of this gym doesn't really have anything interesting. It's like right after this trainer, you come in here. And run straight into another one, of course. Don't let my Pokemon's cute looks fool you, they can whip you. Hmm. A Snubble, okay. I like Snubbles. Snubble, Snubble. Okay, let's move this up to like, here-ish. Actually, let's move it to here for right now. Oh wow, that did nothing. Ah! Oh, pop quiz, you're killing me. It's okay, I understand. This is gonna take a little bit, and then you'll be alright, I guess. I never planned on you being, like, the star member of the team anyway, but, like, oof. This is a little, this is a little rough. Darn, I thought you were weak. Me too, honestly. And then... There's nothing else in here, but there is this one last trainer. I like cute Pokemon better than strong Pokemon, but I have strong and cute Pokemon. Huh. Interesting. That's all I gotta say about it, just interesting. A Jigglypuff, huh? I guess it is strong and cute. Visible confusion. Uh, ooh, we got a freeze! Let's go, dude. Use that big brain of yours to confuse it. <laughs> okay, not too bad. That was alright. And now you're level 18, so I kinda don't care anymore. And switch out. Let the, the, the real Sigma male of the group take care of it. Oh, wow, he burned. Man, we're getting all the status conditions on this person. 
Kind of rough for them. Wow, you really had three level 15 Jigglypuffs? That's crazy. Oh, we didn't get the third SAS condition. That would've been crazy. But it didn't really matter. Whoa, it did matter, because that would've killed. All right, just tackle. Thank you. And bye. Level 19, not too bad, not too shabby. Oh no, no, no! Alright, let's heal one final time. Hi, I'm Whitney. Everyone was into Pokemon, so I got to into it too. Pokemon are super cute. You want to battle? I'm warning you, I'm good. Alright. Alright. So, she starts out with Clefairy. I decided to leave Vesuvius because I'm thinking that he will have the best, uh, the best time handling this Clefairy. And then, um, ooh, Metronome. Pin Missile, that's a great move that you pulled there. Great move. So yeah, I figure Vesuvius will have the best time handling this Clefairy, which can admittedly be annoying. Thunder Wave, oh, that's, that's really annoying, actually. That's like really annoying. Quit using Metronome. Octazooka! Hmm. Hmm. Oh wow, we still hit. That's crazy. Uh, we'll go for one more. Why not? Oh, it's just gonna use Double Slab now. Oh, it's because I knew it was gonna hit five times. And okay, we'll switch out now. So now I figure we go into. Uh. I'll go into... I'll go into Pop It. Metronome again. Spark. Interesting. We'll just use Scratch. I should kill? Yes, okay, so then... Now we have the problem child, which is the mill tank. Everyone remembers Whitney's mill tank, including me. Um, I'm going to personally opt to Leer because it likes to get rollouts going. Um, I'm going to Leer it once. Then what I'm going to do is I'm going to switch to Richter. And the idea is if I can Hit it with some, uh... Hit it with some mud slaps and make it start missing. Um... Then it's rollout can't do crazy stuff like that, Jesus Christ. Uh... <laughs> oh my god, it still hit! That's gonna kill me! <laughs> oh boy, here we go. We have entered the phase of the fight. That's not fun. Smoke screen, please. Oh, it's still hit. Ah, oh, it didn't help. It sucks. Yeah, unfortunately, um, I don't really have a good way to deal with this thing, and RNG can kind of be wonky. What moves do you have? I don't remember, but we're going to send you out. Man, growling it a few times would actually be kind of a play. I'm gonna... Yeah, I'm gonna growl you. Oh, it almost killed me. And I flinched, which means it's just gonna kill me. That's fine. It's 
fine. Yeah, so the, the reason this thing's super annoying is because, one, it does a ton of damage. It's like actually got a, good, a pretty good stat distribution, as you can obviously see. And then also it ends up, um, I think it also has milk drink, which heals it, which is annoying. And then rollout is just a pain to deal with, especially when you're starting with cool lava. So it's just the whole thing. Look at that milk drink. There it is. I don't even know if uh, they let Whitney heal herself, like with items. But if they do, then that's even more annoying. Um, it's, un it's understandable why people make a big deal out of this and have a hard time with it, especially when RNG stuff happens. But I don't think it's too, too bad. Famous last words. Um, I want to freeze it because freezing it would be amazing. Uh, please stop using milk drink. missed. Alright, we're going to have to revise our strategy because I'm not going to win unless something crazy happens. Keyword, something crazy happens. I was making fun of Pop Quiz. I'm like, you're the weakest on the team. Look at, look at him go. He's pulling it out. A well-earned level. Wow. That was crazy. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm sorry. You're mean. You shouldn't be so serious. You, you child, you. Yeah, okay. I'm not, I'm not doing that. You meanie. Oh no, you made Whitney cry. It's okay, she'll stop soon. She always cries when she loses. <laughs> what? What do you want? A badge? Oh right, I forgot. Here's plain badge. <laughs> here's plain badge. <laughs> Just not, here's a plain badge. Here's plain badge. Plain badge lets your Pokemon use strength outside of battle. It also boosts your Pokemon speed. Oh, you can have this too. It's a tract. It makes full use of a Pokemon's charm. Isn't it just perfect for a cutie like me? You were not that cute. I just, I just wanna throw that out there. Anyway, um, so that, that was the first gym battle, or the third gym battle, but the first go around on the third gym battle. That, that's kind of the nature of Pokemon, isn't it? So, uh, we're gonna pretend like that didn't happen, move on for lives. How much money do I have? Oh my god, I have no money. We're gonna have to see. So, we actually have some extra time. So I'm gonna heal, and then we can actually get going onto the next route, I guess. Which is kind of weird to say, but... Also, it's kind of good, so... Alright, let's head out of town. A strange tree is blocking the road. It wriggles around if you talk to it. I heard it became wild when someone wired it with a squirt bottle. Interesting. I wonder how many kinds of Pokemon there are in the world. Three years ago, Professor Oak said that there were 150 different kinds. Yeah, well. Excuse me, kid. Can you do a guy a favor? Can you take this Pokemon with mail to my friend? He's on Route 31. Sure. You will? Perfect. Thanks, kid. My pal's a chubby guy who snoozes all the time. You'll recognize him right away. And we've been given directions to go to Route 31, which is way back. You can read it, but don't lose it. Route 31. Oh yeah, there was a weird tree blocking the road. I wonder if it's been cleared. So, now we have this interloper in our party. And he's holding a flower mail. 
You can take it if you really want, but I wouldn't. So. Now that we have that, we can move on out. Are you going to the gym? Me too. Are you going to the gym? Me too. <laughs> A Vulpix, okay. I respect that. I like Vulpix. Too bad I'm going to peck it to death. I'm feeling a little peckish. Excuse the pun. Alright, lower my defense all you want. It didn't matter. Do you have any more Pokemon? No, okay. Oh, I couldn't win. Damn straight you couldn't. Oh boy, thanks mom. Hi Chris, how are you? I found a useful item shopping, so I bought with your money. Sorry, it's it's in your PC. You'll like it. It's in my PC, huh? I actually want to check that. I'm very curious. I'll be back. What, is it a repel? Okay, I, I I get it. Thanks, mom. Thanks. God, making fun of the way I let's play the game. Mirror. So dumb. Let's fight you guys. I'm gonna show my girlfriend I'm hot stuff. Mm, good luck with that, pal. What do you got? Two Pokemon. Okay. A Sandshrew. Level 13 Sandshrew, okay. I, I was kind of on board and then this happened and now I'm just questioning your life decisions. Wouldn't it be super bizarre to live in a world where having and owning a monster that battles for you and being good at giving it commands to battle and like raising it to be quote unquote competitive competitively viable is like how just how the world works. That's like what everyone does. That'd be weird. But also I guess it would be kind of charming in its own way. This Meryl is kinda of putting up a fight right now. This thing's bulky. Okay, defense curl. That was probably a mistake on your part. Definitely a mistake. Oh, so you got rollout. Oh, pack. <laughs> Get rid of it. I don't want to see it ever again. I wish you would have lost for me. No can do, buddy. I am also trying to show your girlfriend that I'm hot set. No, uh, I have to heal again, unfortunately. My boyfriend's weak, <laughs> so I can't rely on him. Got him. A Pikachu. Level 16 Pikachu, huh? I would hinder a guess. Hazard a guess, hazard a guess. Hinder a guess. Hazard a guess that you are also pretty weak. Considering I could just, uh, you know, Use a ground type. And you probably don't have a good... Ooh, you have double team, though. That's kind of annoying. Oh, man. This is gonna be annoying. Okay, not... So far, so good. No, stop. <laughs> you are violating the law right now. Okay, it didn't matter. I think you did less damage than your boyfriend did. Oh my, you're so strong. Okay, hold on, Ch chill.
Uh, okay, we'll, ju we'll just keep rolling with it. We're gonna fight this guy. I've been getting Pokemon data off my radio. I think I'm good. You've been getting Pokemon data off the radio, huh? And you think that makes you good? A Diglett. Diglett dig, Diglett dig. Alright, not too bad. We'll just go with the usual. Oh, wow. Okay. Like, I, I know Diglett's not, like, particularly defensive, but wow. Well. Wow, I'm impressed right now. Another Diglett. Is this the same level? Oh, I think it's higher level. I'm like 90% sure. Ooh. So close yet so far. Alright, bye bye. I give. All right, let's switch you out of here. Uh, ooh, I didn't mean to run into you. Behold my graceful ball of dexterity. <laughs> what the heck? Who opens a conversation like that? Come on. Behold. My graceful ball dexterity. I kind of like it in a, in a dorky way. Ah, is that what you meant by ball dexterity? A level 2 Vol Voltorb? <laughs> okay, but. I have a feeling. Yep, yeah, I have a feeling. <laughs> level 10, okay. We've stepped up our game significantly. But not significantly enough. That crit doesn't take you out. And we grow a level. Okay. Not too shabby. Another Voltorb. What one's this? Level 14? Might as well keep going with what works. This is like a two shot. Yeah. It's a good thing you don't have self destruct yet. Probably. Level six, okay. Get out of here. Bye. Man, full four Voltorbs. Oh, is it cause it's because of your juggler, right? So you juggle the Voltorbs? Is that the is that the idea? Yeah. Ooh, that was a jolt. I was going to douse you with my prize Pokemon, but your prowess electrified me. You're the best I've ever battled. Huh? You're the one who saved all the Slowpoke? Well, no wonder I couldn't beat you. But if you, would it be okay to get your number? I don't want to miss anything you do from now on. My phone list is already full. You must be really popular. Yeah, so... It is at this point that we can go over the fact that... There can only ever be 10 numbers in my in your phone at a time. Now you can come in and manually delete numbers with delete. Um, I will do that eventually when I get to a person that I actually want to keep the number for. Mom and Professor Elm you can never delete. They are undeletable, as you can see by the lack of delete option. Um, everyone else you can delete, even Bill. Yeah, poor Bill. Um, so we'll kind of modify this as we go. But for right now, I don't really particularly want this guy's number. So I'm practicing my fire breathing. All right, bud. How about you practice your fire breathing in a better way? Magma. Oh, wait, did I, did I switch my Pokemon out? I didn't. Probably for the best. Oh wow, they did half health. Okay. 
And... What else you got besides the Magmar? Another Magmar. Okay, well, that's awkward because I can't hit you super effectively anymore, so... Let's, let's try Pop It. Let's want to see... Oh, it's got Fire Punch. That's not good. That's, uh, that's really not healthy. Not healthy. Oh, it's not healthy. Oh, God. This thing is annoying, actually. Oh, man. It's faster than me, too. We're switching out again. Um... Mm. Let's try Vesuvius, just because um, he should be able to eat the Fire Punch relatively well. Oh, he's using Ember for some reason. How oh, how unintelligent of you. Um, he's cut. Oh, wow, that, that worked way better than I thought it would. Ow, I scorched the tip of my nose. Oof. Alright, let's, uh... Switch you to the front. I'm going to go heal again. Move you here. Heal time. Alright, we're buying one more Ice Punch TM. This one we're going to teach. This one we're going to teach too. Pop it. I'm going to get rid of Leer for it, yeah. Too shabby. I still need to heal, but I just want to teach ice, pu ice punch to him because I think it's going to be a good coverage move to have for the future. And um, we have enough buffer money for Pokeballs and stuff that I feel comfortable enough doing it. So might as well get out of the way. You could play the game of like I'm going to wait for a sale at the the Mega Mart and then I'll go and buy it, but. Pfft. Uh, not worth it. Not worth it. Then we got this guy. Danger lurks in the night. <laughs> I like how dramatic that is. Officer Dirk. <laughs> okay. A Growlithe. Classic. Okay, let's move Ice Punch. To here. I think, yeah, I think that that's a good place for it. Um, uh, honestly, I'm gonna put Scratch up there and I'll put Lick right there for right now. So let's, let's just use Scratch. Actually, I'm gonna move Lick down to the bottom. Alright, I feel better now. Get this Growlithe off my get this Growlithe off my screen. Ooh, speaking hard. The Growlithe. Durr. And Dunzo. So Whoops. <laughs> Yeah, I don't know why a police officer is going around challenging a, a random kid to a Pokemon battle in the first place, but... I'll go anywhere if Bug Pokemon appear there. Uh, good for you, bud. Alright, this guy sends out Venonat. Venonat... I don't know how I feel about fighting a Venonat. 
But I do know that Ice Punch is probably going to do a good number on you. Or Scratch, even. I kind of want to use it just because I have it. Oh, that didn't... Oh, but it froze you. That's what we're going for the whole time. Scratch. Oh, that does way more. I need to, like, remember what Scratch's base power is. It's something like 35, maybe? Oh, that was it. That was all you had? Huh? I shouldn't have lost that. Oh, it's base power is 40. That's what Scratch's base power is. No wonder it's so powerful. <laughs> it's like base 60. Um... Let's move you down, since you're now level 19. And then... Talk to you again. My vet won me the bu bug catching contest at the National Park. Do you get the feeling that there are more rare Pokemon around? I'm positive there are, so I look all, th all the time. If I find one, I want to share the good news with everyone I know. I know, give me your phone number. So, our phone number is still full. Ah, I wanted to... I want to tell somebody about my discoveries. Yeah, so... I don't particularly want his number either. Um, honestly, it's up to personal preference. So, like, if that's the, the thing that he's offering sounds appealing to you, then go for it. Chris, you still awake? This is Anthony the Hiker. Are your Pokemon as feisty as ever? How'd you do in me? We have energy to burn. We hike up mountains every day to work out all our energy. Lately, I've been running across wild G2 quite often. They're usually taken care of. All right, then bye. Or be good. That's what he said, be good. So, uh, I'm gonna make try to make note of whenever there's a phone number available to get. And if whatever they're offering you sounds appealing to you, then you can go for it. So don't pretend, don't act like you have to match mine word for, you know, number for number. What kinds of balls do you use? Uh, that's a weird question to ask a, uh, you know, a young child. Weird question. It's just Ember it. What kind of balls do you use? Pokeballs, dude. Pokeballs. Wow, that was a crit. I mean, I guess it's level 12 and it's Pidgey, but still. A Pidgeotto, okay. Okay. Now we're talking. I don't know how you got a Pidgeotto at level 14, but... Oh, you hate to see it. Now that Gus is gonna do like two damage. Okay, that's still the respectable amount. I'll just Ember him again. Yeah. Yikes, not fast enough. Not fast enough indeed. Yeah, right, what the heck is up here? There's gotta be something up here. Oh. Team of War, that is... That is Rollout. Rollout's actually a nice move. Um, as you could have seen in the... Uh, the battle with Whitney. Wh Rollout's just kind of a nice move. Um, I personally am not gonna use the TM. So, I'm gonna have to pass that one up, unfortunately. Um, so now, now that we've done everything on this route, except for catch the new Pokemon available, and um, as, you know, other such things, we've more or less run out of time. Let's see, let's see if we can get back to the Pokemon Center without running into a new Pokemon. That's not a new Pokemon. Get this thing out of my face. I like its feet. Because they're like bird feet, so I think it's kind of funny. Anyway, so yeah, we're, we're out of time for the episode. We've been out of time for a bit now. Um, I just wanted to like go through all the trainers and stuff and kind of have a nicer spot to end off on. So, get out of here. Goodbye. No, that's over. Um, we're gonna head back to the Pokemon Saturday night off the episode. So, if you like the video, please hit like. If you really like the video, want to see more, consider subscribing. And if you dislike the video, then 
do what do whatever it is they need to do, but otherwise, I'll see everyone in the next episode.